My China Story, the Future Youth Leaders Forum, focused on opportunities to build relationships between young people from China and the U.S. The future of the world belongs to you, dear young friends. And the hope for China-U.S. relations lies in your hands. We encourage the younger generation to visit and interact with each other more often so as to bring hearts closer. During last year's meeting between Chinese President Xi Jinping and U.S. President Joe Biden, President Xi invited 50,000 young Americans to visit China over the next five years. Since then, more than 10,000 young people from the U.S. have visited China. Destiny Batista is among them. A student at Salem State University in Massachusetts, she spent a month this summer studying at Nanjing Normal University, and now students from that school are attending her university. We were both curious about the difference in cultures, um, so they were asking us a lot of questions about America, and we asked them a lot of questions about China, and it's really fun just kind of that interaction. Luke Rankin and Kenny Cryan attend Tri-Cities Prep High School in Washington State. They were part of an 11-day trip to China this summer. So I got to meet people my age, and that was honestly super eye-opening. And I think that always, like, when you go to another culture or another country, it's amazing to really meet kids or people your age because then you see their perspective. They hope their experiences in China will help relations between the two countries in the future. The whole key to better future relations is the youth because if you really think about it, that's, that's who will hold the jobs in the future. And if we can increase the relations between the youth, between two countries, I mean, that's excellent because they'll grow together and, you know, foster that relationship and therefore in the future the countries will prosper with one another. On their trip they had the chance to play basketball with their peers and meet Peng Yuan, wife of Chinese President Xi Jinping. Back in New York, the American students presented signed basketballs from the game in Beijing. Logic A. Men is assistant principal at Lincoln High School in Washington State. He escorted the group and watch them build one-on-one -on -one friendships with Chinese students. It's not always what it is on the macro level. The micro level, you know, means a lot too because, you know, everything that's big was as small at one point. So I trust that they look at it as them being very small, you know, drops of peace and tranquility that when we put it all together, it could, you know, be an ocean of, you know, Tranquility. The hope here at this forum is that young people from China and the U.S. visiting each other will help forge a deeper understanding between the two cultures, setting the stage for good China-U.S. relations in the future. Jim Spellman, CGTN, New York.